imagine a world where every child is encouraged, empowered, and engaged on a daily basis. Together we can make this happen and we can make students from all socioeconomic statuses thrive. Teachers must create a loving and supportive environment in their classrooms. We must use engaging techniques such as integrating the arts and technology into our classrooms and above all we must be advocates for our students' best needs. Community members can serve as tutors and as mentors. They can also help to fund educational needs such as technology in the classroom. Ten. Just like Ms. Edgetati wrote this for the frog, could you please write it for the cat? So if you're going to change... You're really reaching them. You know that you're creating a lifelong learner. You know that you're inspiring a student far beyond simply in your classroom, but far beyond into the future. I have this one little boy in my classroom who had started acting up and he hadn't been acting up um, much at all this year, but I know he'd faced a lot at home. He's currently living in the homeless shelter and he came to me and he'd been kind of acting on, so I was like, Devin, what's up? And at first he was like, nothing, said Shahani. So I sat with him and I let him know that he was loved and he was cared about. And tears started welling up in his eyes. And he came over to me and he said, Ms. Shahani, I'm afraid my aunt's gonna die from a drug overdose. And no third grader should have to deal with that kind of an issue. And he started crying and he just jumped across and he hugged me and he was like, I love you, Ms. Shahani. And tears were streaming down his eyes. And in that moment, you just let him know that you're there for him and that you're, he's cared about and he's loved and he has a safe place at school.